What's up, YouTube? Jersey Gamer 9000 is back on screen for more Mario Party 3. Last time, we finally defeated Wario in Gate Guy's duel map, and we got the Wit Star Stamp. This is, once again, a little recap. I like how they did this, and when you uh, come back to the game. So, yes, we will get the Wit Star. We'll add it to our map. We'll add it to our stamp collection, or actually, it's our first stamp. And now that we got that, as you see, Kindness Stamp is next. That's what we're going to do today. We are going to get the kindness stamp and say. Well, apparently he didn't let us see it, finish it. So we need to head to uh, Deep Blooper Sea on our next board map. And once again, we're gonna watch Bowser be retarded because I don't know why he's doing the dance here, but whatever. Here we go. All right. Yeah, so Bowser finally realizes that there's nobody here, and he retreats. Yeah. Okay, so let's hit the blooper of Deep Blooper C. Do you want to hear the Battle Royale rules? No, I don't want to. I don't want to see that again. Cause we already know how to play Mario Party 3. It's pretty much like Mario Party 2 with expanded items, pretty much. So here we go. We're gonna have more characters. We're gonna play Deep Blooper C at difficulty of. Excuse me, a difficulty of one star. We have DK, Marin, Wario. 15 turns. I can't believe it was 15 turns. I mean, I thought it was 20, because that's normally the basic. But, heck, if they're giving me 15, then they're giving me 15. As we head to Deep Looper C. The problem is about these board maps being 15 turns. You can't do much. Like,. You can't go on the board several times and explore things. So, like I said before, we're gonna get the kindness stamp. There's somebody not here that we're going to be battling after that, but we're not, I don't know if that's even like a requirement or not. But, I'll see that trend continues when we continue the game. So, once again, I'm fourth here. I don't know if that was if I was fourth last time or not. I don't really remember, because that was like four weeks ago. Actually, that was like three weeks ago, even though I've had only two weekends of updates. I remember I didn't upload that one weekend. Ironically, that weekend was spring break. I don't know how I, I managed that one, but... Okay, DK gets to five. There's a bank right early on, so DK will deposit five. So, our goal early on is to most likely do that. So, Mario, instead of losing five, will get five. So Mario's in the first place lead with 15 coins. Good for him. And Wario gets a 9! 9? Okay, now if I can get that 4, that would be good too. And Wario is going up and lands on Bowser! So we're going to have an early Bowser event. And what is going on with there? I love when he does that for some reason. And then he does his little dance. Okay. I guess Bowser wasn't ready because it's the first turn. Oh, 10 coins for Bowser. Only five, though, because that's all he has, because he passed the bank. So, Wario, not a very good start. And I get a one. I guess I can get a three next turn and try to get... Well, actually, will still only be five coins. And we are going to play Boulder Ball, a minigame we've seen. So, we're just going to... Go right to the game. We don't have to explain this much. So, Wario is going to be the one that's going to drop the boulders on us. And we're gonna try to make our way to the top. Start! Why did I go into that? I have no idea. All right, that's no. That's, that's just. Uh. All right. Go go go! If I die, then I think that that's it for us because they're they're not doing anything. Go, 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 go! Yes! Got it. Okay, there we go. We're the best. Just like the game says. Okay, so Mario's in first place because he got the bank. I never passed the bank, so I, I, just, I just have a, I won the minigame at 23 coins. And DK starts off with a 10. I don't remember what a star is, but right on a question mark is also going to be a key to this board map. We'll explain what those question marks do later. And Mario's going to see if he can win an item. And 
now he's gonna get a warp lock. The boo repellent, which is gonna be coming handy. Oh, and a dueling glove, too. Dueling gloves are gonna be, uh... Cool. See, now, see, now I don't have to, like, be, get a dueling glove to actually duel, because we'll have the duel map, so we'll eventually get those anyway. So, where is the star? Oh, wow, it's all the way up there. This might be one of those maps where I'm gonna, we might not get any stars due to the limited turns and being all the way up there. And it's hard to get an S rank if you're only playing 15, 15 turns because you need to have, I think, like a two-star lead or something like that. So I'll do a one versus three minigame and it's gonna be Thrump Pole, a minigame we've seen already. It's already two minigames that we've seen. Once again, I'm by myself. I kinda don't know about this, because I didn't win last time. A, and Z, and... No, B, you moron! B! Alright, I'm already losing. Okay, what's kinda helped me is that they hit a, a snow ball. No! Don't do that! I don't know why I keep hitting Z instead of B for some reason when I get there. They're gonna win, I'm gonna lose. And like, unless they mysteriously hit a snowball, which I didn't think they did. I was one go- I was one away if I didn't screw up twice. I would have had that, definitely. Oh well. So Mario and DK won too many games in a row because they've been on the team of three. And DK gets a six. Alright. So Mario is gonna throw out the duel right throw out the duel and right away here. If I'm him, I will duel if I'm Mario, I duel DK, which he's going to do. I do have twenty-seven! And Mario was able to get 54 coins in that duel minigame, so he won the duel. He now has a coin star at 62, and he will buy the magic lamp. And I already put the crimple in my plans, jeez. Bowser! Okay, I don't know why I'm trying, I don't know why I was doing that. Bowser phone giveaway! Seriously? Seriously. That seriously just happened. So Wario will get a 4. And that's my turn. Here we go. 8. It's kind of unlucky that he got that lamp. Ooh, silly a shopper. And I'll buy the lamp next turn. Well, if I win the minigame anyway. I need to win that minigame. As once again, another 1 vs 3 minigame, we're gonna get a new one here, and it's gonna be Spotlight Swim. This one kinda is not a good one. So here we go. Spotlight Swim. Catch the swimmer by shining all the spotlights on him or her at the same time. Mary is to move and dive, A is to dive. And we're gonna move the spotlights. So all three of us have- all three of us have has to get Mario. So, just keep trying to keep track of him. When he does dive in the water, you can follow him by using the bubbles. So... He's gonna move somewhere over here. See if you can follow the bubbles. Not a very hard minigame if you're the three. If you're part of the three, because, you know. But, if you're the swimmer, and you're version three computer players... Don't really know what to tell you about that. Just try to go back and forth, and hopefully... You'll survive. So DK will get a six and he'll put more money inside that bank. Now I'm making it a ten co or fifteen coins. I forgot I made a ten. And now DK loses three from that same red spot I did. I don't know why that's relevant, but it is. So Mario will use his lamp as he will get the first star of the game due to lamps. See, lamps are going to be key in this game because. With 15 turns, and because Mario won that dual minigame, he was able to do this and able to buy the lamp. So Mario off to a quick lead. Ho 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 ho, minus 20.
So Mario's got it. And let's see where the next star is going to appear. Oh man, if only I bought a key. I might still be able to get a key. So I'm not gonna... Oh, Mario didn't win anything in that item minigame he just played. And Wario's gonna play Chance Time! As you see, Chance Time is uh, a little different here. So let's see what the prize is gonna be. Ten coins! Who will give ten coins? Mario will give ten coins, and who will receive it? Me! Okay, so Mario gives Luigi ten. Thank you, Mario. Now I can afford to buy a lamp and still try to win the minigame if I want to see if I can get that key as well. Actually, I just may use the phone and buy a key. I don't know. Let me look at the map real quick. Well, I can land on two item spots. I just may buy the key. Six. Okay, so this is a tricky intersection here. If you hit the tur if one of these is a torpedo, and depending on the direction you pick, a torpedo will hit you and it will send you in the other direction. But if you don't get a torpedo, you will move. You will keep moving. Now, next turn, I'm gonna buy the key, as this is a four-player minigame. Now, there's two ones we haven't seen, and we got one of them. This is curtain call. Here we go. Koopa, Goomba, and Boo are dancing. Remember who appeared and in what order. A is to confirm the selection, and B is to cancel. You can move around. You can change your selection with the uh, control stick. So these, this game's kind of tricky because they're gonna ask you from the left or from the right. So right now it's Boo, Koopa, Goomba, but it's Boo, Koopa, Goomba from the right. Boo, Koopa, Goomba. Boo, Koopa, Goomba. So, Boo, Koopa, Goomba. Goomba is the first person from the left. And it seems like everybody picked Goomba, and that's exactly who it was. So it's Koopa, Goomba, Boo, Goomba. Koopa. So that's like a, that's like the same thing here. Koopa, Goomba, Boo. Goomba Koopa. I think it's Koopa again, is it not? So, if you do get it wrong, like DK did, he will be out of the game and he cannot win at all. And he will just dance around like an idiot. So, this is the final round. It's Goomba Boo Boo Goomba Koopa Koopa. So it's Boo, it's, it's Goomba, Boo, Boo, Koopa, Goomba, uh, blah, blah. Goomba, Boo, Boo, Goomba, Koopa, Koopa. Yeah. Really? It's been, it was Goomba every single time? Oh my god. So Wario is that as well, as it was Goomba all three times. That rarely ever happens, it's the same person. And Mario and Luigi won! We're the best! So let's get my 10 coins in. The question is, do I buy the key? I think, I, I think I'm gonna buy the, uh... As DK is going to... Buy the skeleton key! That was a good move, but... Is it a move... That might come in vain because I'm gonna get the key this turn with my phone. As Mary is gonna put more money into the bank. Now there's 20. Oh, he might play a shy guy minigame, but he decides not to. He found a hidden block and gets a skeleton key. So he got the item. I think a hidden block can still give you a star in this one. I'm pretty sure about that. I could be wrong though. Could be. Is key. So let's use the phone. We'll, pick, we'll call. I think Toad offers skeleton keys. Ugh. Just yeah. If Toad doesn't offer skeleton keys, I'll just buy the stupid lamp. Yeah. Okay, I figured as much. 
Yeah! Alright, in the five. Let's do it. Let's open this. Oh man. That's saving coins, which is what I was going for there, but now I'm gonna land on Bowser as I get a star! Whoop! Okay, oh, that's a good spot for the star to be. As I get Bowser! Let's see what kind of thing Bowser's gonna do this time. What would be kind of cool would be a Bowser's, uh, reverse... No, not Bowser's reverse, because I don't have a key. I need Bowser's... Suit giveaway? That actually might actually, uh... That actually might be good, in a way. That actually... I don't know, would that be good? It might be good. As we're gonna play a 1 vs 3 minigame, and it's gonna be a new one. Hide and seek. This is sort of like a, a luck-based minigame for the player of three. I'm sorry, for the one for the player of one. This is sort of a luck best a luck-based minigame. The three players are gonna hide, they're gonna have a selection of up, down, left, or right on the control stick. And we're gonna have to try to figure out which, where they're hiding. You move over to the button with the control stick and press A to hit it to hit the switch. And there we go, we found Mario. Alright, so let's see what we got here. We have the tree stomp, the toad house, or the bush. Now, if you don't happen to do any directions at all, as I got nobody there, which is not good. If I happen, if, if they don't happen to, to hit any direction, they will actually lose because they won't be hiding anywhere. So hopefully they're both behind the tree branch. And they are! Wow. They were stupid. If there's two people left with two places to hide, the three teams should automatically win that game. If they're smart. But if you're playing with the computers, they're not smart. So you kind of get lucky as an element first. If DK doesn't go far here, which he gets a four. No, I'm, I'm gonna hang on to the Bowser suit. So he's gonna put the green, and he does not get hit. Which means now there's only a 50-50 chance. As Mario's gonna hit the uh, question mark here. This is a kind of an interesting happening time here. You press A as fast as you can. To try to avoid getting sucked in. But sometimes you want to get sucked in. Because maybe you, you you would go closer to the star. I think if I was Mario, I think getting sucked in there might have actually helped him. I'm really not sure that exactly how that works. Where the arrow would have taken him, because the arrow would have taken him in these kind of like weird looking circles, like right here at the arrow pointing down. And he when he got in, he would have went there. Uh oh, well, whatever. I'll show you later. So yeah, you have, I think, uh, one of three options that you can go to as we play Pipe Cleaner. It's kind of an easy minigame. This is a new minigame. So, try to hit as many Baby Bowsers with a hammer as you can. Hit up A or B, just bring the hammer, or down A or B, just bring the hammer, and depending on what you do is where you're going to swing. Baby Bowsers will try to fool you, the player who scores the most will win the minigame. So kind of like an easy mini game. I'm pretty good at this, so hopefully it's a point. Yeah, he came up kind of fast there. Uh, well, I... No, 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 that way. Oh, I, I, I got that, wow. But because I did... No, this way, this way. I can't believe I'm screwing this up majorly here. Okay, we should have all of them. Oh wow, you can't see who's winning. 26! Got it. I don't know how many there actually are, but I'm the best, so that's all that matters. And there we go, 38. If I can just get another star, that would be good. And there you go. See, and you also, in order to get an S rank, I think you need a two-star lead. 
Um, to tell you, you have to make sure you win the minigame so you can get that minigame star as well. And if you can do that, then... This is actually gonna be key here. Will he get the bullet? No! And Mario, because of it's going in the wrong direction. Now, I don't know if it resets. Or not. But Wario is going in that direction. But... Oh, wow! Um... He got the lamp. This is gonna, now gonna be kind of be tricky here. How many points do I need to get there? All that. Ugh. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. No, no, I won't get there. And the star will probably five. Now I'm gonna do some. <laughs> Now, this should be the, the, the torpedo, and I purposely hit the, the, the got the torpedo to hit me this way. So, I can land on the question mark. And it's all part of my plan to get the question mark star, so I was kind of... That's kind of what I was trying to do there. And I'm on the one side of the one versus three. In hand, line, and sinker, kind of an easy minigame if you're the one player versus the computers. Ritlin the three, who have become fish! If all are caught, the single player wins. So left or right, and aim, and down to just A is to cast a magic hand. This is pretty much like castaways, only you're trying to get them instead of money. So, and they just adjust the direction and press A to move. So, you press A to move forward. And you... Oh, I, I, I guess you don't... I guess, I guess you just adjust the angle, and then you... You press A, you don't have to you push it back like you do in Castaways, like I said. But yeah, oh, well. Like I said, if you're versing the computers, not a bad mini game. I can win the this when I, if I'm the fish. You just kind of go back and forth in the top, and you'll dodge it every time because computers are stupid. Other than that, quite an easy mini game if you're the player reeling in, as you saw. I mean, I guess I I could be making it easy, but I don't know. Who knows? Alright, so here we go. Decay's gonna go, Decay's gonna get a 1. And what's kinda... Well, Mario's... Well, okay, Mario's gonna use the warp lock, I figured. And Mario's gonna switch to Wario, and that's gonna make Wario use the, um... As Mario's gonna get an, uh, an item here. He says no, he... He thinks he tells the truth, he gets the reverse mushroom. The reverse mushroom is like a major key in anything, and Wario is gonna use a lamp. It was it would have been interesting to see if he would have used the lamp, being so close to the star. Then again, Mario and DK were right there, so I I probably would have used it. Given that they were right there, and the chance of him missing it. With a low dice roll. Also could be great. But you're gonna get a star regardless next turn anyway, and you couldn't afford it. So, he loses the star. Oh, he gets the star. And now Wario has won. And the next star is all the way over there. Okay. So now we need to learn another question mark to try to get back up. That's gonna be key here, as getting a 7. Wario, he'll lose 5 from the bank. There should be not 25 coins in there, I want to say. Let me see if anybody's close. Well, DK is 5 spaces away. What the hell? Let's do it. So, with the Bowser suit, we will transform into Bowser. We will try to roll the dice here and try to get 20 coins. And there we go, 3, and I missed it. So... I'm kind of going to do a little cheating move here. Don't have a skeleton key. We go back, and we land on a question mark. I knew I wasn't going to hit him. But, not a question mark for me, and I go to the top. So, hopefully, this this plan works out. As we play another four-player minigame, Messy Memory. We've seen this one before. And because we have, he knows that the book's already open. So, it's an easy start. Three, two, one. Oh, Mushroom! Mushroom, Shy Guy, Hammer, Peach, Luigi, Mario, Yoshi, Wario, Decay, Bananas. I can't believe I forgot to, uh... 
I can't believe I forgot to, to, to um, do that. Jeez. Okay. I know DK is here, and I know Mushroom Shy Guy. Hammer. I don't know anybody else. Well, eh, he's, you seem like you're, you know what you're doing. I'll cheat off of you. Mario DK, I remember saying that. Unless I said Wario DK, I don't know. Then again, I don't... Oh, why did I do that? No, Z. That's what I'm looking for. Did, did, did Wario just move the Yoshi egg and the Yoshi egg was already on the screen? Did I, did I just see that? No, I got all those mixed up. Oh, well. Then again, I know I beat... Seven? And Mario won that minigame! Okay. So apparently Mario sucks. Because apparently he's the best! That's okay. Mario can win a minigame. As long as I win the majority of the minigames and get more of the coins. Now, I don't think dual minigames don't count toward minigame stars. Because you're kind of betting money, so it's, you're not really gaining anything. I mean, you are, but you really, you're taking it from somebody else. And DK is gonna get some items, a poisonous mushroom, and a plunger chest. He's not really moving very far here. It's getting a 4 is Mario. Oh, he just missed that Shy Guy minigame. Or the Game Guy game, as they call it. It's the Game Guy minigame. And Wario will now play a minigame of Toad here. He's gonna do a cheap item, and he gets a rare. He gets the Koopa card, so we can get money from the bank. I'll probably use that next turn. I'm probably gonna say. I get a three, Schliz. That's not what I needed. Well, you know what? That's, that's another star, because now I have a two-star lead in that question mark star, so that's actually a good thing. Never mind. Chip Shop Challenge. Here we go. All I need now is get the coin star. If I, if I keep winning mini games and getting over like 64, I think the number was. And if I can get past that and keep and keep winning mini games, I'll have all three bonus stars, and that's a guaranteed three star lead right there. Unless somebody else gets the star. So let's see if I can do this here. Why am I going first? I should be going fourth, shouldn't I? Oh, I don't know. 1.38. That they might beat me. Well, that's Mario gets an in, he's gonna... Yep. So Mario's automatically won this minigame. However, Wario and the other two players can tie, like Wario just did right there. Now, why didn't I do that? I don't know. So he may have a three-way tie here. Or not, because DK is gonna completely miss. And get 3.18. So, Wario and Mario, the Arios win the game! I'm the best! I don't know why, I just, I just like saying that, I don't know. So they will win the minigames. Unfortunately for me, Mario won two minigames in a row now at this point. Ugh.